You actually think you're better than me. Damn no that one choice. Guess I'll never be a member of the Vortex Club. Damn that one no, choice. Bitch, you won't. <laughs> uh, mind you, this entire game, me and Victoria have not been on each other's side. Actually, I can't stand her good. a lot of work mentally frank and now this oh my god i'm sorry we're not going to a little party oh, this doesn't look creepy at all holy shit this is scary as hell I know. but we're here let's go find the best way in Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. Then we need to get in that barn. Oh, you see that big old log. Please be serious. Is it silly of me to assume there's a little... Warren? Oh, I was just guessing. I was just looking for a little window or something. Chloe! I found the front door. Come on. Oh, this looks nasty. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. God, this is way too Blair Witch. Mm -mm. I have goosebumps all over. Mm -mm. Come on, Supermax. Hey, check out this old chest. A little louder, Chloe. Oh, you're just so comfortable. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, 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 look closer. Harry, Aaron, Prescott, and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescotts bring bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. Oh, girl, I'm scared. What did Warren say? Um... Um, would bruise my fist. The whole fight was so insane. Played your hero dudes. Okay, cute. Thanks, Warren. I appreciate you. Um, somebody else text me. Not my mama, not dad. Courtney. Hey, girlfriend. Let me know when you want to come by my room and I'll give you a fashion makeover. I guess this is how you make friends. This tractor has paid its dues. Oh, it just, it, it creeps me out how things are just so creaky in here. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. Mm. Now, I thought it seems like there was like a little flashback thing. Not a flashback, but it looked like it. Mm. Hmm? <sighs> Nothing here. That's so weird. When I was walking, my controller vibrated. Um, it seemed like there were like some pictures on the wall or something. It's doing it again. Just rotting wood. Okay, you're making me a little nervous. There's something in the ground because my controller keeps. Is this it? Lord. What is this? It's totally brand new. Why? Oh, uh, y'all about to be on some sick shit. I feel it. I feel it. Because there's no reason for you to even have that in here. That's why. Oh, the good old days. A's for 14 cents. Two dollar cocaine? What were y'all into? Oh, wow. Haystacks. So many haystacks. So few needles. Um, how are we? Uh, I don't even want to open this up. I don't even no, want to know. No, Supermax. You can't open this with your bare hands. Were there no pictures on the wall? Okay, Did I... Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. Did I imagine that? I got this. I hope. 
Let me know the second you need Look, any there help. are pictures on the wall. I knew I saw something. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Oh, that's it. I thought it was something worth of worth it, some importance. Damn, those pliers are fossilized. I need something strong to smash this padlock. Girl, are you still all up in that crate? Tractor, can you do anything? Do you work? No, okay. Tracks, crate. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. Whoa. This was in 1903. I'm writing in regards to your outstanding debts that you have chosen to ignore. The Prescotts may not be established business gentlemen, but we are businessmen and expect our due. We take your silence as a personal insult and thus dedicate our family name to making you pay your debt with 10% interest, plus a written apology. If these conditions are not met by the end of the day, July 24th in the year, our Lord and Savior 1903, rest assured, we will make your life a living hell. Wow, okay. That's, wow. Jeez. You put that on the family name, <laughs> we'll make your life a living hell? That's insane. What is this? There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Babes, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't. Maxine, I don't really know what our options are. Um, I see this hook. Attach. Okay. Um, where does this go? It goes up there, which goes on that platform. Can I climb? Chloe, can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Hop, hop, and away, Supermax. I dig having minions. Thank you. Hold motor, okay. Are these the right choices? I, I really don't know. I mean, we're moving along, so maybe it is. With my bare hands? Nope. I can't pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. I need to hook this up to something heavier. Oh, probably the, um, the whatchamacallit, right? This little rewind situation has me real nervous because I, I really don't know when the powers <laughs> click on and off. strikes again. I'm nervous. I don't like this, y'all. I wish Warren could have seen that physics trick. Oh god, what's in here? Damn, this is heavy. What is this? This isn't creepy. Jackpot. Do I even need to say how weird this is? He just did. Who built this kind of place? A Prescott, of course. This bunker is so surreal. I'm so weirded out. This is... Mm -hmm. <sighs> this is too heavy to break, so I'll need a code. What are our options? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. the two, the four, and the five are kind of worn out, but what are the chances that those are in order? Also, does this tie me out after a certain time? Oops, bad code. Okay. Oh, no, it didn't work. You locked it. Oh, that scared me so bad. Why am I playing this at night? Why? <laughs> oh, that scared me so bad. Oh my God. Some numbers look faded, so okay. 
I just have to get lucky. What did I do before? I did two, four, five. Let's do two, five, four, because I didn't do that one. Ooh, that scared me. <laughs> you can do it, Max. Okay, and then let's do our fives. Oops, bad code. It has to be this. Yeah. Oh, yes. I thought that only worked in the movies. Oh, we're so eager to go in here. Why? Open sesame. Lord, they... Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. Oh, we're so brave. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate this. What happened to us taking our what little the pictures? Hell is More survivalist supplies. I'm gonna have to turn a light on in my house. I actually can't do this. I am not brave enough for this. Whoa. This says it all about Nathan. He needs help. Dear Mr. Prescott, as Nathan's primary uh, psychiatrist for over five years, I feel that I should stop seeing your son as you have disregarded my rather dire and immediate suggestions for his and others' well-being. You know well the extent of Nathan's challenges, but I feel that you refuse to acknowledge the role you play in his mental health. If I do not have your support, I cannot treat Nathan. It's as simple as that. I fear he is becoming even more disconnected from reality, even he, even if he acts in a personable manner. You have an, ignored my request for a, consultations, a consultation with you and your wife, so I have to assume you are no longer inter interested in my services. Regardless, I care about Nathan, and I believe he needs serious help. If you want to talk about this matter, I am always available. Damn, the psychiatrist quit. That's how you know. About to be weird in here. Look at this. Oh, girl. I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the world. Oh, what are you into? I don't even want to know. <sighs> that son of a bitch. Stormbreaker bunker. Full estimate, damn near a million dollars. Oh, you know we gotta go on this MySpace. What, what's, the, what's the note say? Whoa. What is going on between Nathan and his father? Nathan, I've told you to never call me using your phone. Stick with the disposable ones I gave you. Ooh, I don't want to hear you screaming out my name in a public place, which you have stupidly done before. I haven't set all this up and shared my vast wisdom just so you could F it up with your teen rage. We can accomplish a lot together, but you have to let me guide you or you're on your own. What's good with this family? Let's see what's in here. Oh my God. No. Y'all got Kate Marsh tied up with some duct tape. Oh, you're going to jail, loves. You're going, oh, yeah. Oh, the biggest, the biggest, the biggest jail we could possibly find for you. Oh, you are going to big, big, big jail. What? These are the binders that we saw at the end of one of those episodes. Kate, Rachel. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. I could tell. We are. Victoria? Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Oh. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. Oh my god. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Well, we gotta get the hell up out right? of here. Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. Hold on. There's a picture of her. Uh, uh, 
there's a picture of him putting her in the ground. Oh my god. This picture is framed different. Rachel is awake and fucking Rachel has passed out and she has something in her mouth. What happened to her? This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. Got, I can't. You got her outside on the ground and you're posing? Oh, y'all are deviants. Oh, this is nasty. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. What the hell? Cause I knew as soon as we walked in here, I said, "Ooh, that's 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 a that's not a normal picture in duct tape." Oh no, I've got to get the hell off out. Mm 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 mm. And you know what's crazy? How are we? We not gonna rewind anything? Damn, we don't wanna put the lock back on the thing? And you know what's crazy too? How are we supposed to tell Victoria? Because she knows I hate her. Chloe, slow down! Wait for me! I know exactly where I'm going! Look, this is it. This is it. You know the spot? Are you gonna help me, Max? With your bare hands, babes? Chloe, stop. Look. Please, no. Oh. <gasps> that smell. Y'all bury <gasps> them. Y'all kill her and oh. buried her at the junkyard? <laughs> Rachel, what? I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. I loved her so much. How can she be dead? What kind of world does this? Who does this? This is a terrible episode. <laughs> Not the ghost deer sitting back watching. What's up with that? Oof. Damn, we still playing? <laughs> Please. We about to go to this party. Girl. I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. Oh, now she in WA. So we could get okay. real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is going to get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. I don't know. I'm tired. I'm burnt out after this episode. I... Oh, she keep that thing on her. Oh, shit. This is like that eclipse. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be too Jesus, moved. Chloe, look up at the sky. Possible. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. <sighs> You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Girl, but two moons, we don't care about... I know, we just found out some heavy-hitting information. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Warren, not you on the hoops. Are hooch. you alright after today? I really flipped out on Nathan. I just hate bullies. And Max, he's dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, 
Have you been drinking? A good four <laughs> loco. If you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. How are hey, they? hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know. Chloe I know. said, "Can we Pain please?" The booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. I'm sorry. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra violence. I understand, Warren. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Warren! Not to me, Warren. Text soon. Oh my god, that's so sad. Is that what half a beer does? My question, and I'm a realist, I just like to ask, how are how are they allowed to have this party on the school campus? I thought the party would be like off campus or whatever. How are they able to have this party on campus? Everybody's a fresh 18. Hi, can I take your coat or anything? And throw on back more loco. And smear no, off ice. I, didn't. Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. It is kind of nasty. Plus some of the Vortex Club always give me attitude. Well, I'm not Stop. gonna talk to Stella. That's what they're here for. Me and Stella. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? No, I'm cool. Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Nathan's creepy? What girl? I think we know what girl. Why does Nathan creep you out? He should. I, I just want your reasons. Is this important? He's a bully for one thing, and he hit Warren for another. But have you ever looked at his eyes? Glazed and raging. True. Me no like. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Anything unusual? Do you notice anything unusual about the Vortex Club tonight? Yeah, I noticed they don't give a shit about Kate Marsh. I'm glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have canceled the party. Yes, I'm not right. cool enough. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. That's so nice. I, really appreciate I just feel that. like. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan, and don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Okay, well, I thought me and Stella were at odds, but she was really nice, so okay, that's lovely. Where? I love this song! Oh, y'all are having a time. Hey, Sid, you're 18. This actually furthermore goes back to the original point that I was making. How are y'all able to have this party on campus, fresh 18, 19 years old, drinking, doing whatever you do? And then the whole incident happened with Kate. That's insane. Y'all just don't give a damn. Oh, I'm shocked to see you tonight, Max. But you deserve a party. You need to find Nathan and Please take him down. To me. Okay, Nathan. Justin said somebody saw two moons so outside. nice to chat up right. another Justin. anime. Oh, there's oh, yes. so many of y'all talking. Oh. You are. That's what I like oh, about Oh, Brooke. Her. I mix up Brooke and Stella. Right? Okay, let yeah, me not talk to so Brooke. Not. Daniel, Daniel, we're cool. Yes, Max Briggs in entrance. <laughs> I only came to the party oh, because of you. I'm glad to see you out and about. Oh, oh, By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott tonight? No, I've been hanging with Brooke since I got here. Max, are you okay? Your face looks so serious. I'm stressed. I know. Uh, I know. I'm I'm not in party mode tonight. You look like you're on a secret mission. This is where it's going to end. For Rachel's sake. Why would you say oh, that? Oh, Max, you need a black whale break. I'm taking Brooke to a Miyazaki show in Portland. If you want to come along, the more the merrier. Thanks, Daniel. I have to stay on my mission now. 
I hope you stay on yours and become a great artist. Well, I'll be celebrating someday in a museum, Max. Adios. Love it. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be rude to Daniel. He is a really nice person. I'm I just... This, ass. this is just such a stressful evening. Because you know I had to stand here. Because I I said, I know that's not Alyssa. I, I knew your day was coming. Alyssa. Girl, what you doing standing Alyssa, by this pool? Coming. I'm on it. Whoa. Of course, my object angel has stepped up every single time to protect me from the cruel world. Thank you again, Mystic Max. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm getting tired. VIP only? Oh, found him. Girl. Hey, girl. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay? Not I know okay. that Max Caulfield is not on any list for the Vortex Club. Nice try. Is that Chloe's listen. voice? No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I should have just snuck in. Why did I check in with you? I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. In a bouncer? Really? Hey, Max. What are you doing in here? Who? If I get sick now, I can drink more later. Oh, oh babe. that shit? Don't do it. I've been there. Is Trust me. Everclear? Oh, God, my stomach. I feel like I'm in y'all's business. Damn, I can't get through this door. I'm really not trying to be in here watching y'all. Yes, you've been vomiting for like an hour. Max is a feminazi, now why am I in it? I really thought I would be able to go in the opposite way. Is it stressful? Yo, stressing? Maximum Overdrive, about time you got here to save this lame rave. Oh, he tore up. Wanna get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Oh, come on, Dana. Um, Nathan, have you seen him? Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore text club. Fucking hate those snobby How do I get in there, Justin? Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. No, no. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. Everyone says I'm intense today. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin, and I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill uh, somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. We gotta wrap this I'm up. I'm torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. Ain't nothing worse than talking to somebody drunk and you sober, y'all. I'm sorry. It's just... Wrap it up. We got to go. I'm like, even if I go on the other side, but I don't really know if the other side is beneficial for me but at this point all i could do is try also where is chloe at lane real whoa whoa what the fuck is going on who did that okay okay whoa whoa who stopped the music okay They're about to drop me. I'm sorry. Who would put a speaker next to the pool though? Can I move the speaker? Never mind. I'm already here. And never mind. I'm already here. Oh, is this the same thing? I thought the curtain was on the other side. No. Uh huh. Oh, y'all have a space. Nathan is the Vortex Club, so his ass has to be here tonight. 
Juliet, Zachary. I heard they wouldn't like Kate Marsh and Vortex Club. Oh, I was gonna talk to Juliet. I see she's a little busy. You dance worse than my dad. Yes. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Should I warn her? Now, mind you, this entire game, me and Victoria have not been on each other's side. Actually, I can't stand her guts. And that's just being real with you. However, I feel like I do need to be a girl's girl in this moment and be like, hey, I know you're not going to believe me, but I, I choose the company I keep a little wisely. I feel yeah, like at least let me try to say something. Uh, did, I'm trying. Let Sorry, me, Max. Let Vortex me just say only. that I did. Sorry, I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, me, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. You still pissed about me taking your picture? Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh killed herself in front of you and me, everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even well, try to blame me. Listen, this is, this, this, we're not going to get anywhere. Let me just tell you the information that I came to tell you. And then you do with that what you want. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. Arr? I'm not the only problem child at Blackwell. This is bigger than a problem child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Do you suck? <laughs> You have talent. You have talent. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. Why are we doing all My this? Let me just tell you the gallery. information. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Look at me. I got the judge of the contest suspended. Yeah, Mr. Jefferson probably won't be choosing my photo. I'm not as talented as okay, I Okay, we're having a heart to heart. Yes, you Cute. are. But we shouldn't have to choose between talent and kindness. I hope. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. <sighs> Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Hey man, I just wanted to tell you were, you were in danger. All this other, this is not Blackwell's best friends club. It's really not. I, I, I could care less. Good. I have real friends. Uh, that's not the way that I meant it. That's the way that I was thinking it. But I, Max, come on. Come I wouldn't on. want a fake one. You try to act like all shy and humble. I feel like you I was doing okay. Of me covered in paint. Who do you think set up the paint can to fall? It wasn't Samuel, dumbass. And you trashed my room after. So she stop did do crying. that. She did do that. You did that? You bitch. You could have killed me with that fucking can. I almost got that freak Samuel fired. And that would have been bad. You're right, Victoria, for once. You actually think you're better than me. Damn no that one choice. Way. Guess I'll never be a member of the Vortex Club. Damn that one no, choice. Bitch, you won't. <laughs> uh, and we still get to choose. Okay, first things first. I didn't know that one choice was just going to like alter that whole conversation. Like, I know. No need, but I didn't know Sam, or I didn't know Max was gonna go in like that. Um, but to be a girl's girl, Max got her little hit in. I do, I do give her that, but let me warn you, just to say I did. Victoria, yeah, I know. Enough of this high school bullshit. Yeah, I know. We're adults now, so listen to me. But I feel like Max your needs to say that. Like, I'm not the danger. one you can mess with. I know you're close to Nathan, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so we could take her someplace. Dark. Oh my god. And I'm the drama queen? It's because that one choice? But I am okay. not fucking around. I'll here. take that. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. I know. His yep. family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. You don't have to believe I don't nothing. Believe anything we try. You say. You're full of shit. Oh, hi. 
Hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Okay. Now, will you listen? Okay. No, I won't. Okay. You're just pissed because you didn't enter a photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist Do we would have need to make her believe us so? You just want to take your little retro selfie. Damn, she going in. It's so fucking lame and lazy, Max. Just go find a community college. <gasps> Victoria, Ooh. please don't do this. Especially after what happened with Kate. Can't you see I'm serious? That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world, so I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Adios. Au revoir. You can't say I didn't try. I tried. Now, whether the delivery was the best delivery, I tried. And that's all I could really do. I tried. Hey. Okay, I tried. <laughs> She's not going to believe me over her Vortex Club partner. And to be honest with you, to be honest with you, do, do I need to make her believe me? Like, a part of me wants to rewind it and kiss her ass, but, like, not really, though. Not really, though. But should I? Not really, Where though. Are you, Nathan? I tried. I really I tried my best. Oh, good. Let's Chloe's go. Here. There you are. Hey, man, those Chloe, are the breaks. Nathan I don't isn't know. here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Why are you as a teacher here? Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh. As a hey, professor, Mr. why are you here? Uh, as a fire are you both professor. Okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh. I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. But I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. Are other teachers here? I think he's still quite upset over the uh the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce oh, the winner of the contest. You're announcing this right. I do wish you would have entered. I know. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. I can't stand when I'm at a little party and somebody want to talk business. Move, please. Ain't nobody want to hear about that damn contest. I didn't submit a picture. Okay, oh, well. Okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Not a roaring I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Not you want to see who won. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh my god! Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. Well, he's not going to San Francisco, so... It was Francisco, your incredible so... photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to the memory of Kate Marsh. Oh, girl, please. She was the real everyday hero of Blackwell. Oh, girl, please. Thank you. Oh, you are Victoria. big on that. Big on that. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Oh, girl. Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Y'all are so fake. It makes me sick to my stomach. It makes me sick to my stomach, fam. Like, I just, I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh, Christ. Nathan just texted me. Uh -oh. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Oh, my God. In the middle of the night? Hold on. This two moon business. How does he know we went to the junkyard? Because we bust that lock and we didn't lock up. We didn't put anything away. We just left everything out. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. 
Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Oh, it is dark as hell. Why are we doing this now? Uh-uh, stay a cutscene. I'm scared. God, I want to fucking kill that little psycho. Big hey, red. I can't focus if you're yelling. Please. Oh, they are out hooting tonight, aren't they? This is a dark episode. The longest episode that we've played and the darkest episode that we've played so far because this is just... So creepy out here. Chloe, I really hope I'm supposed to be Max, following you. please hurry! Okay. I'm not trying to explore on my own. I know he didn't take her body out the... Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Ugh. What? No. Chloe! Chloe! Look out. What the fuck? In the dome? What do we do with that? And we can't rewind because he shot something in our neck? Chloe. Ooh, on top of her body? Oh. Oh, that's nasty work. Mr. Jefferson! Yo, he looks insane. Hold on, bitch. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You mean to tell me this whole time it wasn't even Nathan that was doing the... It was Mr. Jefferson? I told y'all he had bad vibes. I didn't trust him. The way... It, it was first the way that he handled Kate Marsh when Kate Marsh tried to go up to him being like, Hey, I, blah, blah, blah. And he was like, Hey, those are the breaks. I don't know. Second of all, he was just a little too involved in the students' personal lives for me. You, you, mm. you just a little too involved in what the students have going on at all times. And I don't really like that too much. So it was Mr. Jefferson that was doing all the drugging of the students and people this whole time. So what was Nathan's involvement in all this? Because Nathan ain't, uh, Nathan is not innocent. This is a dark episode. Oh, this episode was so dark. Ah. Uh, it was bad that Victoria didn't believe my warning, huh? It's even worse because now Mr. Jefferson is the one. And you know she got a big crush on Mr. Jefferson. But I was just warning her about Nathan. And I don't like her, but I could have just walked away. At least I tried. Okay, you accepted Chloe's request, 53%. You let Warren beat up Nathan. Amen. Uh, no one got hurt, 67%. That, it, that, you know, let me tell you something. In the light, it does look crazy because I rewound for Frank so many times and Victoria didn't get one rewind from me. And that's something I'll have to live with. I, I don't know what to tell y'all about that. That's, that's crazy. What's the next episode look like? That's crazy. That's a plot twist for your ass. Please. What bit? But also, why? Oh, for what? Dude. Why would you be wrapped up in this anyways? Oh, uh, look at his gloves. He's sick. We might as well be watching on 180p with this screen tearing. I just can't. That was the preview? That's all we get? And look at the city. A mess. But hey, hello, how are you? Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for hang hanging in there, y'all. This was a long episode. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. <laughs> Make sure you hit the like button. Leave a comment down below. Tell me how you felt about that plot twist because I, for one, am gagged. Cannot believe, okay? And I will catch y'all either on the Twitch channel or right back here on the YouTube page. And we have one more episode after this. Who knows, y'all? I want to go on Reddit, but I, I'll i wait to go on Reddit until after we're done with the entire game. But I have a lot of thoughts and questions. All right, that's all I got. Bye, y'all.